go. Yo, that's what's up, baby. Come through. My name is Ariel from Ariel's Entertainment Podcast. But you guys already knew that. I don't know why I'm saying that. Guys, we have an amazing guest. We have a packed show. We got homeboy Ty Banks in the arena, baby. So come through, pull up, buckle up, call your friends and family. I'm already excited. I'm out, baby. You come through. Welcome, everybody, to another amazing international national podcast baby look who we have in the house today yeah 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 ariel's entertainment podcast i'm your host ariel let's give a round of applause to an amazing famous worldwide international national guest his name is ty banks come through what's up buddy what's up bro thanks for having me thanks for having me it was a pleasure to do it's a pleasure that i i appreciate the invite <laughs> oh, we appreciate you coming through the show, sharing your knowledge, your wisdom, your love, man, because that's what this podcast is all about, man, uplifting each other. And uh, we're just very grateful you came through, man. Appreciate I appreciate the invite. I seriously do. Dude, straight up, dude. So before we get into you and what you do, you know what I have to do? I got to do the self promo because that's what sells the business, baby. That's what pays the bills. So here we go, guys. Best way to support me, first of all, thank you for all your support. Thank you for your donations. Thank you for your love, your emails, your DMs, your comments. Guys, we're blowing up. We're blowing up every day. So here we go. A great way to support me is, oh, we do it live. Here we go. We do it live. You think I would have it ready, but we don't because that's what I do. Here we go. Boom. ArielEnt.com, baby. That's my merch. You know, once we sell these out, I'll drop some new, some new merch. ArielEnt.com. Almost done, guys. Almost sold out. I'm going to kind of come through. Sticker and pen. We got the music right there. Pull up. You know, I do music. Got albums right there. All right. Thank you guys for listening. I do photography, weddings, quinceaneras, architecture, sports, headshots, live concerts. I do it all, guys. Hit me up. ArielEnt.com. Boom. All right. Another great way to support me is going to my YouTube channel because uh, that's how we spread the word of Ariel's Entertainment Podcast. There I am. We hit 176 subscribers this week, baby. So much love to everybody spreading the word. It means the world to me. Grab the link here, you know, and then go to your phone book and send it to everybody you know. Everybody, your friends, your family, your cousins, your neighbors, okay, your wife and husband. Let's go. Thank you guys so much. 176 subscribers on the YouTube. Woo! All right, guys, I got the donation links down below. The Venmo, the PayPal, the Apple Cash, everything. So thank you, thank you for everybody's donations. I wrote everybody's name on my hand here who gave me donations last week. So here we go. Marvelous, thank you so much. Much love. Drip Squad, you already know. Uh, Carolyn, thank you so much. Much love. Um, Twisted Grape Radio, thank you so much for the donations every week. Nick Fiore, thank you so much, man. Uh, Andy Solomon, thank you so much. And Miss Freitag, thank you so much for that donation. Everybody's listening around the whole world. I cannot believe it. So thank you guys for spreading the word, for subscribing, liking, and following, sharing all the above. So thank you guys. All right. Um, I think that's it. Let's get straight to the prayer. I know that's your favorite thing in the whole world, everybody, because once we do that, we are all on the same frequency. All right, here we go. Guys, we are live here in Denver, Colorado, by the way. We got homeboy here. He said he's out east. You said New York? New Jersey. I'm in New Jersey. Ooh, snap. We are in New Jersey. We are in Colorado. Guys, this is just truly amazing. So here we go. Uh, angel of God, our guardian dear, to whom God love commits us here. Ever this day and night, be at our side to light and guard, to rule and guide. And thank you, God, for having Ty Banks come on the show. We are so stoked for our perfect health. Thank you, God, for our family and for um, our dreams and wishes coming true and providing us for everything we need, God. Amen. That's all I say. Glory to God. That's what I say. Boom. Dude, he, I, the more I uh, praise him, the more I give thanks to him, the more amazing opportunities he puts in my life. Like this one right now that we are having live with Ty Banks, bro. So what's up, man? Tell us who you are and where we can follow you. Woo! 
What's up, guys? It's a, you know, it's really an honor to me um, to come to your podcast. You know, I you know I met you you know through some other sources. So when you reached out to me to do a collab, I was like, hell yeah, I'll do a collab with this guy. This guy is funny. This guy's energetic. Yeah. You know, you're 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 somebody I look at and I say, you know, I want my platform to be like his. So Man, you know. bro. <laughs> a lot. So I, I appreciate that. you for having me here. Bro, I look at your content. I'm like, man, this guy is just legit. He's he just has all. He's just doing all this like worldwide content. This is what I want to talk about. And so, um, I scheduled this with you like I'd say like four months ago, five months ago. Yeah, so, it was a couple of months ago. It was a couple of months ago. Oh, a couple of months ago. And so here we are, yeah. man. This is so awesome. So thank you so much. Definitely. Thanks for having me. So um, I'm Ty Banks live, Tub Talks with Ty. You know, when I'm in the jacuzzi, we call it Tub Talks with Ty. When I'm in the house, we call it Ty Banks live. Jersey, unfortunately, you there? Yeah, I'm right here, boss. Oh, Jer sorry, sorry, Jersey, unfortunately, has um, bad weather today, so I'm not in the jacuzzi. Ah. So today is Ty Banks live. So if you know, if you guys know me, you know I've been on TMZ. I got my own show on Instagram. I got Twitter, Ty Banks live. I got TikTok. Tub Talk with Ty. Cool. Um, I started a YouTube not too long ago, Ty Banks Live. Where I'm starting to upload some clips with it. We're going to start going live on there soon. So make sure y'all check that out. That's Definitely. Yeah. That's, that's my uh, that's my um, Twitter. Yeah, check that out. Boom. Ty Banks Live. I put Ty to Greek. I that's was a big, yeah, I was a big um, um, Greek and Roman times thing. So I put Alexander the Great. I put Ty Banks to Greek. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Bro, yeah. I love the t-shirt. Hashtag tub talk with Ty. Guys, let's do it. Hashtag tub talk with Ty. Come through. He has a Twitter. Um, that is at Ty Banks Live. That's T-Y-B-A-N-K-S-L-I-V-E. And then same on his Instagram, Ty Banks Live. Guys, pull up, come through, and uh, do the uh, comment, share, follow situation. You know what it is. All right. And then... Once you're there, hit up his YouTube channel. That's my YouTube channel. That's my website. Here, let me get it ready. I had it ready. No, no problem. It's, I had so it we, ready. We got up? the name. It's Ty Banks Live on, on um, YouTube. Got it, bro. I found, I got it right here. I had it saved, but I have all these windows up. And you know how I do. I like to be unorganized. There I am. Boom. Subscribe. That's what it is, baby. I appreciate that. That's what we do. We do it together. You just gained another 3,000 followers. Boom. Guys, that's Ty <laughs> Banks live on the YouTube, T-Y-B-A-N-K-S-L-I-V-E. -E. Amazing stuff right there, dude. That's legit. So tell us, man, what got you into doing into, um, tell us what got you into doing your, like your live show. I'll be honest with you. It, it really, and, uh, and you know, a lot of people laugh at this. It, it really started off as a joke. I had just came from Dominican Republic. We just got quarantined. I was in the house. I'm, I'm working from home. Um, and I said, you know what, today I'm going to go on Facebook live and I'm going to, um, I'm going to, I'm going to, you know, I'm going to just talk, talk, talk about dating during quarantine. Mm. So then my homeboy, he was like, oh, you're not a dating expert. So we were just going back and forth. And, um, I had 300 live, I have 300 live viewers on Facebook live, my first ever live time. Like even, even like my ex, she, she told me the other day, she said, you know what, you, I never know you to be like a social media person. So um, unfortunately, you know, we were, we had Corona and everything, but you know, that's when Ty Banks live Tub talks to Ty started during COVID. I would say May, May of 2020. So that's now we're here. I'm on TMZ. I do my own show Mondays at seven o'clock on Instagram live. So make sure y'all, you guys check me out. You said that's on Mondays live on Instagram. Yeah. Mondays live 7 PM Eastern time, New York, New York, Florida, time um i think that's like four o'clock california time yeah that's five o'clock denver time mountain time babe Woo! exactly shout out to everybody in denver I, yeah you know, man I met, I met some cool people in denver i want to make sure i want to travel out there so oh okay you never been here i've never been to denver oh, dude i've never been to jersey <laughs> well i would jersey is cool but um yeah jersey is cool jersey is cool jersey is cool that's what's up man i actually never been to the east the furthest yeah, you got to the east. I would say come there. If you like skiing, it's great to come. I went skiing this past year. Right. But if you like, if you want to like, we have we have Jersey Shore, we got Manhattan and all of that. So 
Jer- East Coast is East Coast is lit. If I if, I think if I moved, I would just move down south to Florida. I would stay on the East Coast. That's yeah. what's up, bro. I actually that's where I've been. The only place that East I've been is Florida, Miami, if, or like, yeah, yep. Bro, okay, all right, here we go. Let's do it. Um, tell us about Ty Banks Live. Tell us about Ty Banks Live. I know it started as a joke, and then you went IG Live. You got three hundred people watching, and then right there, it, I, an idea just went off your head. You're like, I'm gonna start doing this every week. Exactly. So um, it started off as a joke, and then my friend hit me up. They said, you going live today? And I said, no. I said, you know, well, so then, <laughs> said, so then they said, no, go live today. Let's, let's you know, I'm a, I'm a, I'll come on with you. So I said, if, I said I'm not going to go on live. I said, set, I said, he said, all right, I'm going to cash app you $20, you know, for the hour or whatever. So he cash at me $20. So I started putting my cash app down, and people, like, we were talking about dating. We were talking about politics because, you know, the – the election was coming up. We were talking about dating during quarantine. We were talking about, you know, if about, you know, if Corona was real. Cause you know, at the beginning we didn't know. Definitely, you know, prayers to everybody. But you know, we we had some we had a lot of open conversations. So make when you um go back, go back and check out my IGTV and you'll see some of the earlier shows. That's beautiful, dude. And that is again, yeah. um, you started in May 2020 and you go live on Mondays at 7 p.m. Eastern. Boom. That's what I'm talking 7 about. 7 p.m. Eastern. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, bro. So tell me, man, who was your like influencers and role models? Uh, I know this was a joke, but now that you're into this, you're like, uh, do you have any role models, influences into this? You got, you're in Team Z, man. Uh, I would say I, I, have, I have much love for anybody that does this. I won't say anybody specific because... I see a lot of talent out there, yep. and then I see a lot of people that maybe they have a great show, but they don't market it well, or maybe they have, you know, they just didn't get a boost, whatever. Because like I said, I've been on TMZ, I want to say maybe 10 times within the last two years, so I don't, you know, maybe that's why my platform grows so, grew so fast, but, you know, shout out to all the pod, all every podcaster no matter what you're doing, even if, you know, it doesn't resonate with me, I give you credit because it's a lot like, like people just think you just go on camera and you talk. It's definitely not, it's definitely not the case. So I want to say all the podcasters, I welcome all podcasters in my show. You know, we just have respect for conversation. And that's what's up, bro. Thanks for the shout out. Everybody's appreciating that shout out. Um, definitely. Right on, man. Tell me, uh, what have you learned so far, I love this question. What have you learned so far, especially that you started this in 22 during the, the, the pandemic? What have you learned so far that you know now back in 2020 that you know now? I learned that um, if you're good to people, people are going to be good to you. I learned if you're good to people, people are definitely going to be good to you. So um, just because like I have a, my, my show is pretty much open mic unless you're disrespectful to, you know, whatever gender, sexual orientation or whatever. So what I what I realize in doing this, when you're good to people, you, you, you get you get the views, you get the donations, you get the, the shares, you get the likes, you get the saves and all of that. So be good to people. Be, you know, just because somebody says something that you don't like unless it's like totally offensive or off the wall. Be good to people. That's what that's that's what I learned during this. That's what's up, man. Remember, yeah. it's not about left and right. It's about right and wrong, baby. So that's so true, man. Just be good to exactly. people. Yeah, right? Uh, treat people how you want to be treated. Um, just spread uh, positivity and just uh, uplift each other as much as we can, okay? Because that's what I feel. I'm, in, I'm, Dude, I try to help as much people as I can. And that's from like opening the door for people. If I see people just like have their head down and they don't look like they're having a good day, I'll wait till they're like, I'll look around and then if they have their head back up, I'll be like, hey, what's up? I'll just be like, really nice, man. You never know. Somebody could just re- need a, just a hey, you know, or how, what's up, you know? Um, just be good to people by, you know, I help my neighbors putting their trash cans away. You know, I don't, I don't care. I just grab their trash cans, put them away, man. I don't, whatever. I don't, exactly. I, Cause you're a good dude. That's what, and that's, that's one, that's the first thing I noticed about you when, when we met. No, that's great. Man. Oh man, we lost homeboy. 
Oh, no, there I'm he, here. I'm there here. he is. There he is. I got a call. Sorry. <laughs> no, you're good, man. You're Hollywood. I get it. I get it. Okay. TMZ is trying to call you. Be like, yo, bro, <laughs> get in the jacuzzi. We need your, we need your, we need your clips, bro. Straight All right. Up. Dude, I tell you, I tell you, dude, um, that's a good one, man. I love that. I really appreciate that. And one I, thing you notice, I, I remember you, you said something, bringing people up. My, my slogan is let's collab, not compete. Yeah. Just because you have a podcast and I have a podcast doesn't mean we have to compete together. No. I like to collab with people. Straight. If you, if you guys check the history of my Instagram, Ty Banks Live, you'll see there's people that were, you know, came on my show back in January, January, February, March, April, May, June. And you see their platform grow or you see their followers grow and you whatever. So if somebody, if, if people resonate and people start there, like I said, I have co, I've had co-hosts and I have a current co-host. I said, you don't always have to be my co-host. I want you to build up your following so you can start your own show. So that's what I would say. That's amazing, dude. I like that. I like that. Helping the people around you, man. I, I love that. Dude, tell me um, any, uh, what's, okay, here's a good one. What would you say is one of the coolest accomplishments you've done, you've had in your life? In my whole life or just podcasting? Both, whatever. In, in my life, I honestly would say, this might sound corny, but I have two beautiful sons. Okay. And I, I love my sons. I love yep. my sons. Yeah, I love my sons to death. I will hope my sons be, when they're my age, I hope they're in a better position than I am right now. And I'm like, and I'll, I'll admit I'm very blessed. I'll say that. So I hope my, my, my greatest accomplishment, I would say of my son. Yes. And then in podcasting, I would say just bringing people together. Like I see, I've seen it throughout. Like if you guys watch my podcast, you see the engagement. Like I remember one, one live we did, I think it said like 3000 comments. And then I seen people collabing together. Then I seen people starting shows together. I seen people buying merchandises from people in the audience. I seen people buying merchandise from people on the stands. So for me, podcasting, I like to bring people together. It's not, it's not really all about me. And most of my, and I would say 90% of my topics are topics that the viewers chose. I don't, I, I rarely choose a topic. And that's just to be honest with you. Dude, I know. Isn't it cool how yeah. like, bro, uh, I like to call, I've, I like to call my show like the viewer show or the people show because I feel like I don't even have control of it anymore. It's like, <laughs> I, 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 I remember when I was doing podcasts by myself, bro. If you go way back, I, they're still up on YouTube, like from episodes from one to 30. It was just by myself, man. And then finally, mm -hmm. I, people were like, hey, I want to be on your show. I want to be on your show. Dude, now I'm booked out this year, next year. And it, it I, I don't, people just want to come on the show. Hey, I want to be on your show, dude. And I just shoot them a date. And then people are just dropping the comments and love, like on your end, man. Like you said, people are just engaging. People are uh, collaborating. And you see that going down in your feed. And you're just like, oh my gosh, what's going on? And you want to like uh, comment back and um, give them feedback and reply back and stuff. But your hands hurt from all, the, <laughs> from all that hanging on the phone all day working, bro. Tell me about that. Exactly. Um, well, me, my norm, my norm and I'm the five. If you know me, I work for an electric company, but this is, you know, a joy. This is something that, you know, like I said, it's been on, you know, TMZ. Um, I've been in the tub. They let, you know, much love to everybody at TMZ. Um, much love to, you know, all the content creators that I've collabed with. Much love to my co-hosts, former co-hosts. Anybody that joined the stage with me, anybody that took time out of their day to say, hey, Ty's going live at such and such time, I'm going to cancel my plan. Because, you know, and even though we're, you know, we were in the times we're in, just the fact that somebody took an hour out of their day to watch me talk, of it, you know, that that shows that, you know, that shows a lot. And I really appreciate it. To, Bro. You know, former co-host, current co-host, um, former guest, current future guests, everything. I would, I just want to say thank you. I really appreciate it. Bro, bro, let's go a little deeper. I've actually seen it with my own eyes. Let's go a little deeper. Let's, let's talk about the hate we sometimes get in DMs, right? Uh, or in, in our comments, right? I've seen comments like that. And I just appreciate them taking the time out of their day just to even give the hate, man. Like, that's awesome. You went out like at your five, 10 seconds out of your day to get some hate. That's cool. And then I'll reply back. Sometimes I'll be like, 
uh, like if they'll say, hey, your vocal, like your vocals suck. And I'll be like, hey, thanks so much for the feedback. I really appreciate you seeing my Instagram. God bless. Boom. Next thing I know, they're following me. <laughs> this is like, what I do with, uh, this is what I do with most people. If you, forgive my, my phone is ringing off the hook. No, you're good, bro. Forgive me. For people that took their time to say my, my show is trash or my show, <laughs> I could have did better than that. If you check my timeline, you'll see that I always reply to them. And I say, yeah. thanks for taking time out of your day to watch the show or for taking sure. time out of your day to comment. Because if I watch, like I've seen some, like I support every, mostly everyone. If, if I saw a show that I thought, you know, the person could have done better or I thought it was trash, I'll keep it real. I've seen some shows that were trash. I'm not going to put that on their page because... Maybe they had a bad day. I know I, I had a show one day and I think I had coronavirus and I fucking, you know, did it. I was like, I had a temperature of <laughs> 101 degrees and people didn't even notice. And they were like, oh, you know, your show was great. And I was like, yo, you know, my temperature was like over 100 degrees that day. And like, I, I just did it because, you know, people were expecting it. People were waiting. Yeah, and stuff. Right. My co-host was waiting that day. Right? Stuff like that. Jeez. So I always say you could be anywhere in the world but you chose to be in my comment section throwing hate or showing love. And I appreciate it. Right. Keep look. I always say, keep their name, keep my name in their mouth. Good or bad. Cause then if somebody, if, if 10 people are saying this guy's show is trash, I bet you three or four people will go see, let me go see if his show is trash or not. <laughs> and if ten people are saying this show is great, maybe a hundred, hundred people will start watching the show. Yep. You yeah, dude. I I get it. The only time I actually like delete a comment or like uh, block somebody is when they like they put some like real hate, hate. You know, yeah, what I mean? like racist. But, or yeah, or, yeah, like homophobic stuff. Yeah, like yeah, yeah, yeah. That's when I block, delete. I don't even waste my time on that. But yeah, dude, that is some great info right there. And I also wrote down here it's about collaborating. It's not about competing because I actually I actually feel that what we're doing right now, man, is like us tour, like us touring. It's like. You coming to Denver right now, giving like an hour, like a 20 minute open mic right now, right? And you didn't even visit here. You didn't even travel here. So I'm about to put you on over here on my side and everybody here on my end is going to listen to you, man. Like if you traveled here and then some, man. And then it's like I traveled to New Jersey, dude. Podcasting goes a whole deeper level, bro. Exactly. And then when, when, if, I, when I come out to, if I ever come out to Denver, I'll definitely hit you up. I'll let you know. Dude, I'll pick you up at the airport. It's not a big deal. <laughs> all right, brother. I got the limo, bro. What you need? <laughs> Don't lie, all right. bro. All right, all right. Dude, uh, I got a couple more questions here because I know your phone's ringing. TMZ wants you. Here we go, bro. What are your favorite kind of hobbies besides your like your 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 amazing show that's going viral every single day? Uh, for my show, uh, well, for my hobbies, I'm a big football fan, American oh, football. Boom. Okay. Yeah, I'm a big, you know, don't judge me. I know you guys are out in Denver, probably Broncos fan, but I'm a, I'm a big, I'm a huge, huge Eagles fan. I'm a big, okay. Okay. I'm a diehard Philadelphia Eagles fan. I like to travel. I like to go to the Caribbean. D Dominican Republic, Aruba is my favorite two islands. Um, my mom's Jamaican. So, you know, if you ever hear a little accent, that's, that's my mom coming out of me. Okay. Um, and I want to travel. To, I want to travel to Africa. If, if we if things open up next year, I want to head out to Africa. That's beautiful. I've, I've been, I noticed I have a lot of African support from Ethiopia to Nigeria to Cape Verde to Ghana to Senegal to Cameroon everywhere. So my wow. show, you know, my shows, thankfully, has been gone international. So I, right. I, I appreciate all the African um, following, and I and I want to head out. I want to hang out, hang out with you guys party with you guys eat the good food meet you know the beautiful women out there everything that's amazing i got it right here man shout out to dominican dominican republic aruba to your family to your mom man that's legit and i hope that uh you know god's gonna put all those travel plans in front of you you just gotta be ready you know and appreciate uh, that brother yeah of course man the more like it's just gonna come into your life man tell me about football i'm a broncos fan but i'm more of a tom brady fan okay okay so I'm happy that, you know, we won our first Super Bowl against Tom Brady a couple uh -huh. of years ago. So that, I remember I had a, I, you know, I do my reels that um, 
the Heart Heartbreak Chronicles. So uh-huh. It was like a joke. I was dating somebody and it didn't work out. So every it was kind of like public. So I, I do like a Heartbreak Chronicles, like joking around. And then, you know, people were like, you OK? And I said, no, the last <laughs> time I legit cried was when the Eagles won the Super Bowl. Oh. So I, I'm a diehard Eagles fan. Damn, so. you definitely die hard. Dude, do you play Madden? Yeah, I play Madden. I'm on Xbox One, Ty Banks Live. I'm Woo! no Ty Banks 2525. Bro, I'm all about Madden, but I got a PS4. Okay. So, what you know, um, my son has the PS4. I think we're going to get the PS5. So, just yeah. add me, Ty Banks 2525. He plays, you know, I... yeah, he plays all of those games. He's on it. When he comes yeah. here, he's on, he's on the PS4 all the time. That's beautiful, man. Last question here. I just want to say, Ty, thank you so much. So much I for coming on. That, brother. I really do appreciate it. Dude, you came at, you came on and kicked some ass, bro. I want to say thank you so much. I want to grab one of those t-shirts from you. Next time I see you, I'm grab one of those t-shirts. Uh, where can we get those t-shirts, man? Uh, my, it's, it's my, actual, my little brother actually makes them, so they come by order. We haven't like done a merchandise thing yet. Oh, dang it. Gonna, yeah, we're definitely going to start selling them. Oh, okay. Let me know when you get them going, dude, because I'll definitely cop one. That's for sure. All right, brother. Appreciate that. No problem. Last question here, bro. Uh, I just want to give everybody first, let everybody know where they can follow you one more time. Here we go. Here we go. The Twitter. we got the Twitter right here. That's Ty Banks Live at Ty Banks Live, guys, in the Instagram as well. Ty Banks Live. And don't forget to subscribe to his YouTube channel. Boom. You know how I do. Let's go, guys. Ty Banks Live. Thank you guys so much for listening. Ariel's Entertainment Podcast, arielent.com. The links are down below for the donations, guys. If you guys like this, like, share, follow, subscribe, and then tell your friends and family, guys. Spread the word. Um, This is an amazing show. We all know how much we're so honored to have Ty Banks on the show. Um, Last question. Here we go. Um, This question comes from... Our guest, uh, let's see here, Brian Allen. Uh, the question from Brian Allen, dude, um, says, Ty, any advice for anyone going through a tough time? I would say if you're going through a tough time, just think about what's important to you. Think about your family. Think about your goals. Think about when that tough time is over there, you know, that everybody goes through tough time. Myself, I go through tough times. I'm sure Ariel, if you've gone through some tough, tough time, I'm sure the president Biden going through tough times. I'm sure the former president Trump goes through tough time. Everybody goes through tough times. So just think about your end goal and think about the people around you. Think about the people you love. Think about the people that care about you. Think about the people that you care about. And then you could get through anything. Trust me when I say that, because I've been in some, you know, some situations that I was like, oh, shit, you know, I don't know what's going to happen tomorrow. So to get through a tough time, definitely think about the people that care. All right. Beautiful. Guys, you heard that. That is Ty Banks, baby, leaving the arena, dude. Thank you so much. Come through anytime. We're going to stay connected. I'm going to hit you up, bro. Thank you so much, man. When I come out to New Jersey, hitting you up as well. Thanks for having me, brother. Dude, God bless. I want to see your show on TMZ. Let's go. DJ, you already know what to do. Drop that track, baby. Woo! <laughs> Yo, shit goes hard That's in the paint, up, bro. Guys. That's what we do. Liked it. I forgot to give the date today. Today, September back, 23rd, 2021. I can't believe it, man. One of my dreams came true. I had a guest from the TMZ show on my podcast, guys. Ariel's Entertainment Podcast, arielent.com. Ty Banks is going live here on Mondays at 7 p.m. Eastern. Boom. All right. Guys, Ariel's Entertainment Podcast. We're available on all podcast platforms. I'm talking about iTunes. I'm talking about Apple, Spotify, iHeart, Amazon, uh, Google, Tidal, all the podcast platforms, guys. So check me out there. Let's see what else. ArielENT.com is the website. Make sure you guys do the hashtag Tub Talk with Ty, okay? All right, all right. Today, guys, I want to say thank you so much. I'm so honored. Make sure you like, share, follow, subscribe. Now you know what I do. I turn up right here. Shout out to Rocky Balboa. That's my favorite movie right there. That inspires me so much, okay? ArielENT.com, Ariel's Entertainment Podcast. Go binge on all my shows. Grab the links and share it with all your friends and family. I want to say thank you guys for all your comments, your DMs, your donations. Truly means the world to me, guys. God bless. I love you guys. Let's go.